and welcome to me playing some Sonic Hacks to Sonic, well actually it's not Sonic, it's more uh, Knuckles Emerald Hunt. If you like the gimmick in Sonic Adventure 1 and 2 where you are looking for emeralds, then you are going to love this hack, because this is what this hack basically is. It's got other difficulties. Um, I'm going to go for normal this time. What it is, is basically you are looking for emerald pieces as knuckles. And they can be in the level, they can be hidden, they can be in bad nicks, they can be in anything. But the idea is to basically beat your times. As you can see, I have already played some of this. But I'll show you what it is like anyway. It's actually quite a fun hack. You've got the Emerald Radar at the bottom there, and you d you're basically playing Sonic 2 levels, but when you're near an Emerald, the Emeralds will turn different colours. Green means you are near them, yellow means you are drastically near them, orange means you are basically very close, and red means that you are basically on top of the damn thing. So, be easy enough, but one is obviously in the bad nick. There we go, and I have gotten two already. The next one is not that far behind, so, and you'll know when you're getting away from it because it'll turn yellow, then green. So it was back here, I'm going to guess it's in that bad nick there, and boom, there we go, we have just completed that level. Quite simple, eh? Well, some of the emeralds can be really dickishly placed. I don't know if it will be this time. But we'll find out. But when I was in Casino Night Zone, there was an emerald at a drop point, and you have to jump specifically to grab it. And I did not really have that much luck getting it. Um, what I have noticed is that the emeralds stay in the same area on each difficulty. So if you've been playing it a lot, you're going to know where the emeralds are. Me, I'm playing it now on normal. So I have no idea where the damn things are. But the levels can range from Zone 1 and Zone 2. Right, I'm not having much luck in this one this time. Uh, it's telling me one's up here. Now, the ability of Knuckles can glide, but he's still quite limited. So it can be an absolute pain. No, I can't get up there. Okay, I'll just go down this way. I don't think you can skip level. No, you can't. Okay, well that's a bit of a pain. Um, it's a very nice hack, obviously. If it had some custom level design, I reckon that would make it a lot better. Uh, I do remember the Sonic Show playing a custom Knuckles hack, uh, which was Pumpkin Hill. And it was really well implemented, he can even dig to try and get the emeralds. That would be a nice feature to see in this one. No, I, I don't know what happens if you get to the end of the stage. I'm wondering if you get a walk back. Let's find out. I'm going to go this way because I swear one's in here. Oh, 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 oh. One is here. Where? Saying I'm directly over it. What? This is here. Oh, there it is. There we go. One piece. Which is a very good show, actually. But I meant One Piece of the Emerald. Um, I tried to watch One Piece. I got into it, but sadly, there's so many episodes, I could probably only watch about 50 at a time. Then I move on to something else, like Fairy Tale, something similar. Uh, anyway, back to this game. Oh, wait a minute. Ah, there's one. Okay. So now we're coming to the end. Ah. Uh, what? Wait, what? That's bizarre. Okay, so, yeah. Teleported to the front of the stage. Right, so there's one here. It's got to be there. Right, okay. Is there any way I can cheese that? Let's have a look. -see. What? How did I do that? Oh. Okay, I just clipped through the floor. I also noticed that we can keep our shield, which is pretty... Oh, there it is. There it is. 
Right, how the hell do I get that? Uh, there also should be more access to the level so you can backtrack and go forward. Like I said, e even if uh, not level design uh, difference, then maybe the shutters should be open so we can explore a bit more. Anyway, I'm going to take a wild stab in the dark that I've got to go down. it here? No. Or maybe I was going to go up. I, I don't know. Oh, don't tell me I'm doing this again. Oh. I might jump cut, guys. Right, let's try that again now, guys, shall we? See, th this is the only problem, that you've got to backtrack and the pipes are linked. And you have to go in a certain one. I think I needed to press up, not down. So let's try again. So random. Let's go left, left, left. There we go. Right, so I've gone left, and hopefully this is where the emerald is. Because I know where it is. Let's just be careful, though. It's down here, isn't it? No... Okay. Let's try this way. Oh, oh, it's flashing. Okay, so it is here. Is it up here? No. It's saying it's around here. Don't tell me it's there. Okay, so it's up there, which means we have to take the pipe which goes up this way. And that pipe is... Oh, I hope it's the... That one. That one? No, apparently not. Unless it is that one, I don't know. Oh my god, where is this goddamn Chaos Emerald? Eventually. It has been 10 minutes and I still can't find this bloody thing. It's there. How am I going to get there? It's not making any sense to me. Uh. Gotcha. That took way, way too long. Oh, God. Look at that, guys. 11 minutes. See, sometimes it just doesn't work with the level design. Um, Let's try Casino Street. Uh, Casino Night. Sorry. Casino Street is from Sonic 4, which is a game which... A lot of people think he's good, but I personally think it should... Uh, according to some people who I've heard from when I was watching a live stream, Sonic 4 was not actually going to be called Sonic 4. Now, personally, that would have done him favours. Because it would not have gotten half as much shit from the fan base if they didn't call it Sonic 4. If they call it Sonic... Uh, Adventures 2D or Sonic Blast 3D 230 or whatever, I think it would do a lot better than it actually being called Sonic 4. Because it did not live up to its expectations and it was pretty badly programmed, to be honest. Right, so we've got two emeralds, now we've got to get one more. Where could it be? Where could it be? Oh look, that's definitely a Sonic 4 look back, isn't it? Making you use springs and bumpers, uh, springs and dash panels. Oh god, that game. 
as a as a 3D Sonic Advance game or 3D any game, I would have accepted it. But Sonic Advance 4, uh, Sonic 4, as in meant to be exact from the classics, it, it didn't even make any sense. It was just like the Death Egg exploded, the Master Emerald was back, and then Sonic suddenly, on his own, trying to defeat Doctor Robotnik with. A load of old gizmos. Did not like it. It could have done with so much better re representation. Right, now I've got to find this last emerald. Where the hell are you? Oh, it's going to be a drop emerald, isn't it? There it is. Got ya. Well, that's, that's nice. There's a spring there, but like I said, chemical plant, oh my god, that was, uh, that was something else. Anyway, let's continue, shall we? Um, you know what, let's go to Metropolis and see which one it is. This is one of my favourite songs in the whole of Sonic 2, but my favourite song, which no one would probably imagine, is the Supersonic theme. Oh my god, I love the Supersonic theme in this game. And fun fact, I didn't realise Supersonic even existed in Sonic 2. Uh, because I found out about Supersonic in Sonic 3. So, to my delight, when I finally got all the emeralds in Sonic 2, which took me a very long time when I was a kid, I heard the Supersonic music, and even though there was bugs left and right all over the place, like... If you finish a level and you have rings and you jump and you turn into supersonic, it can glitch out. But uh, it was the music was amazing and the look of him was brilliant. I, I just I was gobsmacked when I found out he was in Sonic 2. I see the bad nicks are still about as uh, annoying as the rest of them. Right, like I said, the problem with this is you just don't know where they are. And they could be in a different route con uh, entirely, so you might have to go down two different routes. Which makes it padding, but at the same time that's technically what Sonic Adventure 2 did with their butchered emerald system. So, let's have a go. Oh, oh, it's flashing. Does that mean I'm getting close or I'm getting further away? Let's find out. Could be further away, no, my luck. Isn't kind of... Ah, goddamn crab. Uh-oh. No rings, not good. Oh! That was not clever. Yeah, this is basically what you're doing. I, I don't think there's any other thing to this hack, but if you like the Sonic Adventure 2 thing, then by all means, you, you, you'll like this. Because it's just like Sonic 2 levels with emerald hunting mechanics in it. So, yeah, if you want to try it, go to Sonic... Hacking contest and it's called Sonic. It's called Knuckles Emerald Hunt. I'm Ali Star. See you in the next part, guys.